There's another exciting development in our Philippine Navy. Unknown to many, the Spanish shipbuilder Navantia has offered its Alpha series of surface combatants to meet our future corvette and frigate requirements under the Rehorizon 3 phase of the revised AFP modernization program, RAFPMP. Navantia is one of the respondents to the Request for Information, RFI, released by the Philippine Navy a few months ago for the upcoming new frigate requirement. This means they are in the running to provide us with the next generation of naval power. Imagine having state-of-the-art warships capable of engaging in modern naval warfare. Additionally, Navantia has a local representative, meaning we could have local construction and maintenance of their warships here in the Philippines. If selected, we would not only get modern warships but also create jobs and develop skills for our fellow citizens. Sources indicate that Navantia is flexible in their offer, willing to adjust the design to meet the specific requirements of the Philippine Navy. They are ready to offer their latest designs, such as the Alpha 3000 light frigates, corvettes, Alpha 5000 frigates, and Avante 2200 corvettes. The good news is that the Philippine Navy leadership is interested in Spanish warships, Spain is offering long-term soft loan financing and counter-trade deals for these ships. Practical, advanced, and budget-friendly. What more could we ask for? If all goes well, we could see a fleet of powerful, modern, and locally built warships flying the Philippine flag. Navantia's offer includes the Alpha series of surface combatants, featuring several state-of-the-art designs. One. Alpha 3000 light frigates and corvettes, these vessels are designed for versatility and high performance in various maritime operations. They offer advanced sensors, weapon systems, and the ability to operate in both littoral and blue water environments. 2. Alpha 5000 frigates, these are larger and more capable vessels, designed for sustained operations in high threat environments. They boast robust anti-air, anti-surface, and anti-submarine warfare capabilities. 3. Avante 2200 Corvettes, these are smaller, more agile ships ideal for patrol, surveillance, and interdiction missions. They offer a balance of firepower, speed, and maneuverability. One of the most compelling aspects of Navantia's proposal is the promise of local construction and maintenance. Navantia has a local representative in the Philippines, which means that if their proposal is accepted, a significant portion of the shipbuilding process could take place domestically. This would not only expedite the delivery of new vessels but also stimulate the local economy by creating jobs and fostering skills development. The economic and industrial benefits of Navantia's proposal are substantial. The local construction of warships would create numerous job opportunities for Filipino workers, ranging from skilled trades to engineering and project management roles. Furthermore, the transfer of technology and expertise from Navantia to local shipyards would elevate the capabilities of our domestic maritime industry. Financing such an ambitious project is always a critical consideration. Navantia, backed by the Spanish government, is offering long-term soft loan financing options. These favorable financial terms make the acquisition of advanced warships more feasible for the Philippines. Additionally, Spain is proposing counter-trade deals, which could further reduce the financial burden and promote bilateral trade. The addition of Navantia's Alpha Series vessels to the Philippine Navy would significantly enhance our maritime security. Modern warships equipped with advanced radar, communication, and weapon systems would enable our Navy to detect and respond to threats more effectively. This enhanced capability is crucial for safeguarding our maritime interests, including the protection of vital sea lanes and natural resources. Navantia's proposal to the Philippine Navy represents a transformative opportunity. The acquisition of Alpha Series surface combatants would significantly enhance our maritime defense capabilities, stimulate economic growth, 
and foster technological advancement. The combination of advanced warships, local construction, flexible design, favorable financing, and comprehensive training makes Navancha's offer highly attractive. As the Philippine Navy continues to evaluate its options, the potential benefits of partnering with Navantia cannot be ignored. The prospect of a modern, powerful, and locally built fleet of warships flying the Philippine flag is within reach. This development underscores our commitment to strengthening national defense and securing our maritime future.